You're watching Daily Dish. So this month we are celebrating World Humanitarian Day and a Utah company is leading the charge. That's doTERRA. Yeah, here to tell us more about that in the sponsored segment is Missy Larson, Vice President of Philanthropy at doTERRA. Hello, Missy. Hi. Good how to are have you. you. Thank here. you. So the, we're celebrating and honoring humanitarians around the world. How are we doing that? You know, it's, if you know doTERRA, you know that it's the world leader in um, essential oils. But what you might not know is the incredible humanitarian work that is done with doTERRA and in um, the doTERRA Healing Hands Foundation and also Healing Hands initiatives throughout the world. So it's an incredible place for people to celebrate humanitarianism, mostly because even if you just take the oils, the oil support in developing nations over 300,000 direct jobs that are that are there. And these are through um, sourcing and co-impact sourcing, which we go in with doTERRA Healing Hands and support the work in those communities with humanitarian work. So if people are watching right now thinking, how do I help and support doTERRA? How do they do that? Yeah, there's lots of ways to do that. doTERRAhealinghands.org has a number of ways to get involved. One of those, um, if you are a doTERRA wellness advocates or you know of one, you can do what's called the match program. Find a community project and doTERRA will actually match that project in the way of the, if you fundraised $5,000 and are a wellness advocate, will match that. And it's an incredible impact within these communities around the world. Well, doTERRA has created a model for what you guys do. And I know when you go into these communities, you're helping so many and that helps another, it just trickles down. It trickles down with not only the farmers, what's behind the bottle, the incredible, If I mean, even looking at just some of the problems that we deal with in this world today. Human trafficking is a known problem that we deal with. If you know you're sourcing and you're ethically sourcing within these regions, you take away a lot of the different layers of sourcing there so that you're supporting those communities directly and you minimize the risk of trafficking in those areas. That alone is really incredible, but add on to the community work that's done through humanitarian work in those communities and you support so much more, whether it's water, medical hospitals. We just opened this incredible hospital in Sanag, Somaliland. And at convention this year, we'll be talking so much more about that. So people that are interested in getting involved can actually attend that. And speaking of the convention coming up right here in Salt Lake City in the next two weeks, and it is for everybody? Everybody can sign up and come along. Where yeah. can people go for more information? At doTERRA.com for that. Uh, and if you're interested in doing humanitarian work with us, doTERRAhealinghands.org. Thank you for all that information on today's sponsored segment from doTERRA. Uh, that website on your screen, uh, and we'll put the link on ours at abc4.com slash daily dish. Thank you again. Thank you.